Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video. Mistral has published another new coding agent and its name is Devstral. Here you see, and in their blog, they have written introducing the best open source model for coding agent. Yes, it is open source and it is completely beating GPT 4.1 and also Quen 3 latest uh, model. And all of that I will discuss in this video. And also I will show you how to use it with this VS Code client and uh, what are the options available. Okay. So here you see today we introduce Devstral, our agentic LLM for software engineering task. Devstral is built under a collaboration between Mistral AI and All Hands AI. It outperforms all open source model on SWE bench verified by a large margin. Here you see that uh, Devstral is here and this Quen 3 is here and uh, all other Dipsig modelers here. So that means this Devstral has a lots of capability and lots of performance and accuracy than the other models. Okay. And here you see that while typical LMs are excellent at atomic coding tasks such as writing standalone functions or code completion, they currently struggle to solve real world software engineering problems. And uh, for that, this Devstral is designed to tackle this problem. Devstral is trained to solve real GitHub issues. It runs over code agent scaffold such as open hands or SW agent and it defines the interface between the model and the test cases. Here we show Devstal performance on the popular SW bench verified benchmark. A data set of 500 real world GitHub issues which have manually screened for correctness. We also compare Devstal to closed and open models evaluated under any scaffold and here we find that Devstal achieves substantially better performance than a number of closed source alternatives. For example, Devstral suppresses the recent GPT 4.1 mini by over 20%. And here you see GPT 4.1 mini is here and this is Claude 3.5 Heiku and this Devstral is actually beating both these two models. And if I show you the pricing, here you see for this GPT 4.1 mini, the input token price is for 1 million tokens, uh, $0.40. And for this Claude 3.5 Heiku, it is $0.80 per million input token. But for this Devstral, if I show the pricing, here you see that it is only $0.1 for the part uh, 1 million input token and 0 0.3 dollar for for the for 1 million output token so that means this uh, dev style is giving the better performance than this uh, this plot 3.5 heiku and also this gpt 4.1 mini but the pricing is very much less so why will i go for this uh, gpt 4.1 mini or this plot 3.5 heiku I will go for this step star because for the low price, I am getting the best and better performance than these two model, right? And also here you see that for the local deploy deployment and enterprise use and for this copilot, this agent mode dev style is very best. Now how to use this? There are two ways. One is this with Olama, another one is this with uh, open router, okay? and it is completely free they have written so this open router link is given in description go there you will find this page and here under this api click here click on this create api key and here make your own api key by clicking on this create api key button okay now after that if you want to use it through this olama then the size is here you see 14 gb so make sure you have the uh, virtual RAM to run this Devstral. If you run it through local uh, Olama, Devstral, the best open source model for coding agent, right? Now I will use through this open router. So after you got your API key, go to your uh, VS Code and there go to this extension, select this client or root code, whatever you are using, and open that. And here go to your settings. And here under this API provider, select this open router, open router API key, 
and in this model select this mistral and uh, this depthral okay depthral small free so select this free version right now after that for this plan mode also do the same thing now click on the same now rest of the things i think you know that how to work it with this client so this was the video i think this uh, video is helpful for you guys and you got to know many things from this video if you found helpful don't forget to like this video don't forget to share this video with your friends also so see you guys in the next video thanks for watching and also please use this model and uh, create one website and let me know your experience in the comment section